what's going on, guys? All right, we got Playboy the Beast. Let's go, Brandon 2.0. So did he do one before? I haven't I haven't heard that one yet. But anyway, this is uh, his newest his newest uh, song. I think it dropped a few days ago. I'm not sure, but uh, featuring Ty the Tyrant. Okay, Ty the Tyrant. Uh, don't know who he is. Never heard of him. Joe Biden. This it says it right there. So you know, I gotta check this out. Of course. All right, uh, Playboy the Beast. Uh, I've done uh, I think two reactions to him so far. They did pretty well. So guys, get this up there. I know I got a good bit of subscribers. I think the first time I did a reaction to him. So yeah, he. He tells the truth. He spits nothing but uh, straight facts. Obviously, he is not signed to any major record label because there's no way he would be able to say the stuff he says. So I'm all for the way he thinks, all for the stuff he talks about. So let's get into this. Uh, let's go, Brandon 2.0. Like, share, comment, subscribe. Also go to his page, do the same. Uh, I will drop it in the link. I'll drop the original video in the link and a link to his page. All right, let's go. Uh, yeah, play. Oh, okay, already I love the beat. Oh, my God. Look at this idiot. Yeah, none of these pictures are fake either. That's for sure. This is all true. Look at this moron. Let's go. Look at that. Look at that dumbass. All right, um... Yeah, already I love the beat. It's got like a mafia sound to it. It's got like an Italian sound. It, that's what it sounds like to me. Let me know if I'm wrong. But yeah, let me know if you think that too. But yeah, it definitely has that mafia type type sound to it. You could hear that playing in like The Godfather or something for sure. Definitely. Or a mob type movie. All right, let's go. Let's go. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. Mm. Look at this. <laughs> One, two, three. Let's go. Real picture. Go back and look at that picture. I don't know how old that girl was, but she's definitely underage. And I mean, guys, okay, I'm not even gonna stop. You, you, if you're listening to this, you already think the same things that he thinks. You already think the same things I think. You know what's going on out there. You know what these sick ass perverts are about. So let's, we're just gonna enjoy the song. I'll stop it here and there. And there it is right there. Look at these people smiling. That's a fact. All right, here we go. The whole world chanting, let's go, Brandon. The dudes who ain't confident, and I really can't stand it. I'm pretty weak, demanded, but the country's in a panic. Cause I know what they're thinking, I was sick like Titanic. True, it's a man, but y'all took him for granted. We was eating good every day, sick and summer. Now we hit it to the feminine. I'm not being dramatic. Now they come up with your guns, and they fully get a medic. They say they're gonna plan it, they may just work planning. They sound like some coming, coming for your guns if they fully automatic. Okay, wow. All right, that's crazy. There is evil in the woods. Okay, yeah. Yeah, oh, is he talking about, um, uh, Bohemian Grove? Is that what it's talking about there? Okay, all right, let's go. We was eating good every day, second summer, now we get into the feminine, I'm not being dramatic, now they come up with your guns, and they fully get a medic, they six, they don't plan, they just work planning, they sound. I want to see what that's, I'm sorry guys for the pauses, I'm so sorry. I don't, I don't want to miss anything. Whatever you do, don't fall asleep. Oh, okay. I thought that was like kind of a creepy, like, horror type thing and they were comp he was comparing him which he probably is too like don't fall asleep definitely if you're a child around this pervert um and also obviously the trolling of you know the fact that he falls asleep all the time he's so damn old i mean he can't even stay awake no matter where he's at. I mean, he's a robot, guys. He's a damn robot. That's my... I, I have my doubts whether it's a human being in there, to be honest with you. I really I really wouldn't bet on that. He... he I mean, it's crazy. But let me know what you think. All right, let's get it. They medic, they six, they done planted. They majors were planted. They sound like the truth because it's too problematic. They call for the leak coming for the whole planet. Mm. The medical government broke the planet. Damn. Woo! Planet, but now you're riding on the trans. And it's FJP. You're from really being candid. Yeah, I don't promise if you were born as a man. Oh, God. You can try to get to me. I never come with taking plans. You know what the Democrats are doing. Damn right. Damn right. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. All right. Let's get into some facts here. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. All right. Let's get into some facts here. Who was it that started the clan? Look at this shit. You're not, you're not a woman if you were born as a man. I mean, 
I don't know why that's even a discussion, but yeah, of course, that's the truth. Who invented the Klan? Democrats. Republicans did not invent it. Yet, what does Trump get compared to? Klan, a Klan member, a Klan leader, Hitler, white supremacist, all this bullshit. Um, you know, and they've done that for years and years. They've done that for 200 years. Who was it? The, one of the presidents back in like, what, the 1800s? I think it was Lyndon Johnson. And he said, you know, we've got these people so fooled. I'll have black people voting Democrat for 200 years or more. Uh, maybe it wasn't him. Please let me know if I'm wrong about that or that quote. I think it was him. But he was a Democrat, and he's saying, he's basically saying that these people are so stupid, we've got them fooled thinking we're on their side, and that's the way it will continue to be. And I mean, some people are fooled by the Democrats' agenda. They promote all this racial equality stuff, and they act like they care. They act like they're all for minorities. They are not. They're for them staying in the place they think they belong, which is under their thumb. The elites... Uh, you know, the people in charge, um, elites, people in charge, same thing, uh, the, the, politi the Democrat politicians, and guys, I'm not saying every Republican is good or anything like that, I'm, and, and I mean, I'm saying for the most part, they're bad too. I mean, I think Trump is kind of the exception, and I'm not even for sure about that completely, to be honest with you, but it looks like he is the exception, and he throws huge monkey wrenches into their plans. He definitely did in 2016. He's not a politician. He can't be, he can't be bought. He can't be, you know, under, under their thumb to do what they want him to do like every other president has, Democrat or Republican in history, is my opinion of it, on it. That's just me, okay? And um, what was I saying? Oh yeah, the thing about the Klan, of course, Democrats are the ones that invented it. And is am I wrong on this? I think Republicans are the ones that freed the slaves as well, or that had something to do with it. I'm not sure. I'm not a big history person like that. Um, but yeah, from what I've heard here and there, but it's all, they lie about everything. So who created the Klan? It's the Democrats, not the Republicans, as they would have you believe. They say that every Republican is racist. You know, that's their whole, that's their whole media tactic. And how, when did we start hearing Trump was a racist? We never heard it before he started running. I know that. I know I never heard a bad word about him from any race of person. Uh, <laughs> nothing. And then... As soon as he's running against Hillary, he's a white supremacist. He's Hitler. He's dangerous. He's a threat to democracy. Come on. Come on. Mm. Mm. Damn. What is Antifa? Somebody let me know. I've heard that a lot here in this last week or so. Ever since the Trump shooting, people have been describing it as a they, had, they, they, they weren't saying Antifa had something to do with it. I'm guessing it's like a militia group, but I don't know anything about it. Let me know what that is. Sickness. Yo, hey, okay. Hold on. Now, guys, I'm sorry. I'm pausing again. But look at this picture. Look at this guy right here. Now, that's Joe Biden if you couldn't tell, because it's very difficult. Does that look anything like the guy we see today? I don't think they look anything like, yeah, of course it's like 20 years ago. But when you go from 60 years old to 80 years old, you can tell it's the same person. There's not that much of a dramatic damn change. Now, you know, 30 years old to 60, 30 years old to 80 years old, of course. there's uh, That's not going to look like the same person at all. You probably can't tell that, oh, that's the 80-year-old that you know today in a picture where they're 30-something years old, typically. I mean, sometimes you can, but I mean, for the most part, probably not. But you take a picture 20 years ago when you're 80-something years old, 60 to 80, you, yes, you're going to look different. You're going to look older, obviously, but you're not going to look like a completely different person. That's why I say this dude is a robot. I'm telling you. It's crazy, though. All right, but let's 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 continue. Oh, that's a fact. Oh, this administration want to take my guns, but it just won't happen. Sniffing every single little kid on the bus is a pedo. Now, that's not a kid, though, is it? Oh, I bet that might have been his daughter, though. 
I bet that was his daughter. Because that didn't look like a kid. Hey, maybe it was. I don't know. It just it looked like an adult. But I bet it's his daughter. The one that said he took showers with her when she was eight years old or something like that. Look at this dipshit. This happened. It gets no traction. The media is all a distraction. America never fuss over bandit. Let's go bandit. Let's go Oh my god, oh man. Uh, he's going off. He's going too much. He's going too crazy. He better watch himself. I, again, guys, I can't believe YouTube allows this to be put out there because this is not fit with their agenda or the media, the elite's agenda. And we know who controls social media and who controls the internet. So, I don't know. I'm kind of surprised. It's confusing. We give them the power, then they just abuse it. We cannot say the election was stolen because it will ban us before we just pose them, destroying our country. So, what is the motive? It's total control. Bro. Yeah, that's what they go. These Democrats, demons, I swear they got soul. It's the plan is to weaken our soldiers. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. No. Uh uh. He's, too, he's, he's being too honest. He's being too honest. These Democrats, demons, I swear they're all soulless. Guys, when I say shit like this, when I say stuff like they are literally demons, I'm not me, or, or I don't, when I say they are demons from hell, when I say they worship the devil, and I've said that on several of my videos, Obama, Harris, Clinton, uh, you know, and, and, and Republicans too, guys. I'm not saying they're, they're, all, they're all good or anything. I'm just saying definitely the Democrats, Obama, Biden, if Biden's even a real person, he might, he might have been dead for years, who knows. Um, all of these people, they're demons in the flesh to where their body, their, 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 uh, their bodies have been taken over by actual demons from hell. Or they're not actually demons, but they have given their soul to the devil himself, to Satan himself. And I literally mean that. I'm not meaning it metaphorically. I'm not meaning they sold out for money or some shit like that, some weak shit like that. I'm meaning they literally have sold their soul to the devil. They worship the devil. They follow his every word, his every plan to destroy the world, to bring sickness, perversion to everything on earth, to every TV show, to all music, to all uh, movies. What do we see? What do we see on every show in every movie for the past like, what, five to ten years or so? Who do you think controls that? Who is in control of movies and shows and what goes through them? The elites are in control. Whether you want to say they're demons, reptilians, whatever. But this guy is on point with this. And I say this kind of stuff all the time, too. So he knows. He knows what is going on. So I appreciate the fact that he's being so damn truthful about this. These Democrats, demons, I swear they're all soulless. That is a fact. They worship Satan. That's, I mean, that's a fact. How can you approve of abortion? How can you approve of gay marriage? How can you... They are trying to get pedophilia re, um, legalized to where we need to accept these people as, as a minor attracted person, that it's a sexual orientation. It is something that they cannot help, that is not a choice that they are born with. It should be okay to us for a 25-year-old to rape a 10-year-old, to rape a 5-year-old, whatever, because that's the way they were born. They're a victim. Fuck that bullshit. Absolutely insane. You telling me they don't follow the devil? Get the fuck out of here. There's nobody that does that shit if they don't follow the devil. Come on. I swear they got soulless and globalist plan is to weaken our soldiers and ban all our guns for an easy takeover. It's Trump 2024 time to take over. Let's go, Brandy. Do I need to say anything else? Oh, Kid Rock, okay. Again. Look at this dumbass. Damn. 
Uh, okay, got the Rambo picture with Trump's face. All right, what's up? Oh, okay, hold on. We're going to pause on that. We're going to pause on that. Where can I get a shirt? Come on, shoot your local pedophile. You can take the word local out. I don't give a shit if it's local or get me a, get me a ticket. Get me a, get me a flight booked and I'll go and take care of one or how many ever you got. You point them out. No problem. Shoot your local pedophile. It don't have to be local. Yeah, take care of the local ones too. Take care of all of them, definitely. Oh, Lord, yeah, I need a shirt. Where can I get a shirt? Let's go. Yeah, go get your shirts now. We all need that. If you don't support that, then I don't know what to tell you. I don't know what to tell you. If you support if you support that bottom word there, people being like that, then, I mean, you, you need to burn in hell with all the politicians that I just mentioned, to be honest with you. I mean, I don't feel a bit of remorse for you if, you, if you're trying to accept that kind of shit. So, let's go. You're not Trump. <laughs> That's crazy. Yeah, but but we're the threat, right? But, but we're homophobic, we're transphobic, or whatever bullshit they come up with. Yeah, we 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 we're wrong for being against them. And I mean, I mean, I, I'm I'm against it whether they're shooting people or not, because it's fucking insane for people to be this way, and it's a fucking choice for people to be this way to do the shit they do. Whether you're gay, whether you say you're a damn woman when you're a man, or the other way around, or you're neither, or you're a fucking dog, or you're a fucking can of coke, or whatever the hell. God only knows what people say they are now, what they identify as. Get get rid of this bullshit, please. My God. All right, let's go. Hold on. No, not again. Not Tom and Nova. Oh, Lord. Come on now. Oh, he's going at him again. Yo, what the fuck is this shit? He showed this picture of Tom before. I think the first track I ever covered of Playboy, it was a Tom disc. And, um... He showed that same picture when he, he called him a devil worshiper at that point, too. I know Tom, I think, I'm pretty sure Tom did used to be into that crazy shit, but I don't think he is anymore, is he? I mean, because he mentions God, he mentions, you know, he mentions the right one now, and he does throw shade at, like, satanic rappers and all that shit. Hey, I don't know, obviously they got a beef going you know, that's between them. But what the hell is this? I've never seen this picture. Nova leaning over the Baphomet symbol. So that's Baphomet, of course. That's where all the, that's where all this shit comes from. That's a smooth transition, <laughs> pun intended, I guess. All right, but that is a smooth transition from this bullshit to the Baphomet thing because Baphomet is not man or woman. He, it's a demon that's both parts, and that's where all this bullshit, that's the demon they're serving by promoting this agenda. This is crazy. Yo, this guy is speaking truth. I can't I can't say anything bad about it at all. They praise in Baphomet. That's not the half of it. Trump was a threat to these seas because he's pat oh my god. That's a fact. That's a fact. They do not want him in there. They cannot control him. That's the problem. I know Nova's got an upside down cross on her neck as a tattoo but I, again i don't know if she was into this shit because they were both hooked on drugs for years i know that so they were probably into some wild crazy dumb stuff at the time okay so they could have and i think i've heard even tom say that he was like kind of satanic at some point maybe or other people have said i don't know for sure but um so that's that doesn't surprise me from him i don't know about nova like i say the thing on her neck the upside down cross that's kind of weird but um, I don't think they're like that anymore. I mean, I, at least I really hope not, of course. But I mean, because I, I like both of them. Um, yeah, so I don't know. All right, let me know if you know any more about that. That's crazy, though. He's, he's going after him again. 
Damn. A threat to these girls because he's passionate. Infections are coming, they'll try to provoke. More racial division, the panda for both. Yeah. They probably put it in Bohemian Grove. Oh. I can't afford the media control. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Now, I mentioned Bohemian Grove earlier, did I not? A thing about the woods. And there he brought it back around. All right. Yeah, we know. That's all they do is pander for votes. They try to, they get the LGBT bullshit vote. They get the trans, whatever, all that stuff, all that crazy sickness. They get those votes because they, I mean, and they do rock with it. They do support it, of course, because they're all like that too. I mean, damn, they're PDF files themselves. So, I mean, there's nothing worse than that. So, of course, they're going to support anything else. There's any type of perversion at all. But, um, yeah, they pander. That's, I mean, that's what the Democrats do. They call Republicans racist, claim they're for equality. They're on your side, minority side that's the farthest thing from the truth completely all right so what's what's what was this there's bitch right there that's that now that's a demon from hell for sure you look at that i mean look at that face right there i happened to pause it i didn't even mean to do that right there but look at that face right there you tell me that's not a demon satan forgot to give her her human face before he sent her to earth he just forgot to give her a human face. He just said he, she was. I guess when she, when he was sending up his horde of demons to walk the earth, he was just handing out faces. He was handing out the mask one by one. He just he, he forgot one. I mean, he slipped one. Devil makes mistakes too. Yeah, he just he just let her go. He said, "Hey, go on up." But she still got her demon face on. It's no disguise. It's not a human face. Oh my God! We're plotting at Bohemian Grove, where all the politicians, uh, Democrat and Republican, it, do the elites meet there too. I'm not sure if the elites meet there, like Rockefeller and Rothschild and all them, of the thirteen families. I don't know if the Pope and ship meets there. I don't know. They might. That might be a whole separate meeting place for people like them. The elites might not even go anywhere. They might not even ever be seen. I don't know. I don't, it's 13 families I know. I couldn't name any of the other ones. All I know is Rothschild and Rockefeller, which is crazy, which, is, which tells you right there that they have done a masterful job at deceiving everybody because we don't even know their names. And th that's me. I'm sure you guys probably know some of the other families. That's just me, though. Um, they're, yeah, they're going to they're gonna plot their next move with more global propaganda to how to destroy people that aren't falling in line with their agenda, like Trump, like other people. They're going to plot. There's the owl right there that they, uh, Moloch, I believe. This shit goes deep. It's crazy. It's crazy. There's evil, true evil in the world. We see it every day. And they're running the world. The people that are like this are running the damn world. Hold on, what did he say? He, he's going too fast. Never sell, okay, never selling out or backing down. Uh, I'm keeping my soul. There you go, okay, let's go. Hey, hey until he comes back, until that guy right there comes back, it's never going to be right. It's never going to be right. Evil's never going to be gone until he comes back down to take care of all this of all this stuff going on, it will never be right. But that's the only hope we got. Right there, coming down from the sky. All right, let's go. Let's go okay, Trump. Hey, Alec, jo Alex Jones. Nice. How many years did he tell us about Bohemian Grove before it was actually pro proven right? He snuck in there. That's a that's a. That's, 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 that's the man right there. I'm telling you, he, he's all over this stuff about these elites and all. Also, uh, Epstein Island. Didn't he talk about that for years and years before they ever found out it was true for sure? People just, they, they think people that have these theories are just insane. And I mean, whether they're told to say that about them or not, which a lot of them probably are, just to, again, fake news. They 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 laugh it off. They promote. They push it as propaganda. That these people are out of their minds for saying this crazy stuff. Our politicians would never be into stuff like that. Uh, the world leaders, the rich people, would never be into doing stuff to kids, right? You know, they would never be into that. Absolutely not. Because we, I mean, if there's anything we know we can trust full, 
full-fledged is definitely the government. Am I right, guys? I mean, give it up for the government. I'm glad I'm glad they got our best interests at heart. Damn, I feel safe. I know that. Anyway, all right, shout out to Alex Jones. Is that a real picture? It uh, probably is. I'm sure he promote I'm sure he's pro gun, of course, but um yeah, that's a, that's a, that's the dude right there. Yeah, I, I like Alex Jones. So he he's talking. He does say some stuff sometimes. It's off the wall, but hey, for all we know, that shit could be true too. I know he has been wrong on a lot of stuff, but he's been right on some really important stuff as well. Look at this. You tell me that's not a demon. Damn. Now who is that? Was that a kid back there that was blurred out? Oh lord, it probably was. Falling asleep. Bye bye bye. They you know. need to say bye bye with a something in his head. Okay, hold up. P.S. F. Kamala Harris, too. Yeah, absolutely. You're next. Woo! Okay, so he's going to do another song. Let's go. I'll, I'll have to react to that. I can't wait. Oh, my God. There's endless material. What's that going to be? A damn week-long song? Because, I mean, it, there's no way you can fit everything into a song, a regular song. Just just start just start one day, and then I guess we'll see you the next week when you finish it, I guess. All right, let's go. Damn. Okay. Oh, that's right. He he was a part of that January 6th thing. Yeah, that's right, at the Capitol building. He actually served time for it, too. So he's saying, let our, let our boys go. Yep. Cause we've seen the footage. We've seen the footage. The police were letting them walk in. There was no threat. It's that damn, what was it, uh, Nancy Pelosi. She, she called off the security so they would be let in and then so it would look like there was a raid on the capitol building when there was really nothing and then this whole thing would start because she knew trump would be blamed for it i mean come on can we not see this can we not see what's really going on out there all right that's it oh wow all right that was great i enjoyed that one uh the the beat was insane i loved it uh, you know to be honest other than the very beginning where the like the strings were playing or whatever, I, guys, I don't know instruments. I apologize, but whatever chords those were, or strings, sounds. Where I said it sounded like mafia shit, I love that. Of course, I didn't really pay attention to it or hear it that much more because the words were so, you know, captivating. What he was saying, he was he was really talking his shit. So I love that. Uh, well done. Obviously, like I say, go like, share, uh, go like and subscribe to uh, play, uh, the Beast's channel. I'll drop it in the comments. Please, if you could, give me a subscription as well. I need them. Uh, trying to build this channel. It's, it's a slow process here lately. Um, I don't know why or what's happened, but anyway, get this video up. Share it if you could. Comment it comment on it like uh it all helps in the algorithm so i appreciate you guys love each and every one of you uh blessings on each and every one of you as always uh thanks to the most high once again um be careful out there guys love you guys i'm gone